She likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine. She likes notes that say I love you all the time. Roses at your feet, baby girl be mine. Baby girl be mine. What's up everyone? I'm Mary Dominique and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. Today we're gonna to be talking about my style guide for the summer. Maybe looking in your closet like, I need to go shopping. And if that's the case, then this video is definitely for you. All of these trends for summer are fresh, but totally nostalgic. I try and stay on top of all the trends. I'm constantly on Instagram and I'm always pinning outfits and looking for the new and the next. Even with quarantine, I feel like all of the new styles have been on point. I love fashion and I love styling, so this video has been really fun to make. For every outfit, I try to incorporate two or three new trends that are happening right now. But without further ado, let's get started. For the first outfit, I chose this rouge like halter top and then this scarf this is one of the biggest trends right now drawstrings and like rouging you're gonna see it on skirts and dresses knit tops in general are just becoming really popular this is kind of like a sweatery knit material it's really comfortable a little warmer if you're going to wear it into the night these silk scarves are making a comeback I love wearing it as a scarf or bandana. Here I paired it with some longer hemmed shorts, which are also a huge trend. I kind of stuck three trends into this outfit. I just paired it with some nude heels. This outfit is probably going to be worn more than once. Next we have this outfit, and I also stuck a few trends into this outfit as well. Oversized chain necklaces are basically always in style, but they've really made a big statement for this summer. And what I love so much about these chains is you could wear it with an outfit that's a little bit dressier, but I've also been seeing girls wear it with like a big oversized hoodie, so you can wear it with casual outfits as well. All over the runway this summer, we have been seeing corset tops. They're making a huge comeback. And I'm talking, I've been seeing girls literally thrift old like corset silky tops from like the early 90s and it's such a great trend. It cinches your waist and it just looks so good. Here I have it tucked in with some baggier denim. We definitely love the straight legs. This outfit, honestly, it's pretty simple but it just makes such a big statement. I didn't go overboard with any of the accessories just because I felt like the chain was enough. Definitely an outfit that you could wear out with the girls for some drinks or a date night outfit. It's really fun for the summer. Button downs are huge right now. I've been seeing it all over Instagram. More of like this satin vibe, but I've also been seeing girls do kind of like plaid, like more dad vibe. I'm using animal print because honestly, that's just like my favorite. I got this from Zara. I never thought to really use it as a bathing suit cover up, but now that it's such a trend, I'm like, honestly, it looks so cute. I have it here with this bathing suit that I got from Pretty Little Thing. I love that it's strappy, so I added a strappy heel. You could always wear just sandals or something like that. What I love about this top is you could kind of wear it into the night. Probably would wear jean shorts like I have here. It goes from like a bathing suit right to a going out top. I love it. We have this fabulous little woven basket. I showed this to my mom and she was like, oh my god, Mary, I can't believe that those are back in style. But they're so cute for summer. I love putting all of my items in here and I'll do like my Louis Vuitton wallet and just kind of dress it up. I really love that it's clear and see-through and it definitely adds so much style to an outfit. Next are these BDG shorts and then this little tie top. I've been loving all of Garage's clothes lately. I love all of their like little tops. The material is so good and washes so well. Knotted front tops are huge for the summer. I really love how it looks. I love that you don't have to wear a bra. Uh, this particular shirt is really thick, so I definitely love the style of this one. These BDG jeans are so cute. They're giving me such 80s vibes. I love how they roll up. They're a little longer. They're really high waist and super comfortable. I get these from Urban Outfitters, but the brand BDG is so nice. They're very well made denim. I thrifted this bag. I think I got it at Goodwill for like literally two or three dollars. I am a huge thrifter. If you didn't know, I'm always getting items from the thrift shops. Everyone's always like, what? Like I paired this with some 
strappy shoes. I just wanted to do something a little more fun. With the like cowboy hat vibe, I wanted to do a suede boot. This hat is everything. It's my first really nice hat. I got it from Olivia and Pick, I think you say it. It's such a fabulous hat. I'm so glad I discovered this brand. I'll be wearing it a lot this summer. Basically all of quarantine, I think all of us have adjusted to wearing comfortable clothes and spending a little more money on athleisure outfits. These like drawstring boy shorts are going to be my new best friend this summer. They're like sweatpants for summer and they're so comfortable and again I love that this longer short is back in style because they are so comfortable and just they hide more and I love it. I love the color of these. They were literally $10 on Boohoo. There are so many bloggers that are posting these exact ones. They're like selling out like hot cakes. But I finally got my hands on the Sandy Nude ones. Paired it with just a little black top also from Garage. I love how this wraps around your body, so I'll be wearing this a lot of different ways. One of the biggest trends for summer, and I'm so happy that this style came back because it's so nostalgic for me, Air Force Ones. I've been wearing them in my other videos. Air Force Ones are the most comfortable shoe, and with like the little sports socks, which are so popular also, it gives you such a vibe, and it's been basically my go-to for the last few weeks. For this next outfit, there are a few trends that I tried to incorporate in here as well. Biker shorts. I mean, of course, they kind of made an appearance last summer and they totally made it through to summer 2020. So I love that. We have this double like tie cutout shirt. Cutouts are also so in for the summer. I absolutely love this style. They show a little skin. We have this clear bag from one of my other videos. Canvas straps are so popular and they're really casual. I would wear this to like do errands or like run around. It's casual, but it still has that like stylish vibe to it. Also wanted to show you another way to style biker shorts. Graphic tees are everything. This specific one I got in Houston, I thrifted this as well. It's like an old, cute Gwen Stefani one. I love the shirts being like super oversized. This is so cute with a little fanny pack, some silver hardware, it's really fun. You could wear it like knotted in the front, you could wear it big and baggy like I have it here, and then use the fanny pack to kind of cinch your waist. Again, just using the socks and the Air Force Ones. I just love the vibe. I'm waiting for like a chunky silver chain in the mail right now because I know that that would just like complete this look. Next up is this glamorous Chanel vibe. You may recognize it from my spring looks video. I bought it in white. Sheer is literally all over the runway and I've been seeing it on so many Instagrams and bloggers posts and I just needed to get a white one for myself. The lingerie is coming back and people are wearing it as little bralettes and shirts. I'm sure you've seen the trends of like lacy bralettes with blazers. I love that too. Here I wore a lingerie piece underneath this white top. Another trend that I incorporated was tying your shoes around your pants. I love that trend. I also did that in another video of mine but I wanted to just reiterate that it's such a fun trend and a cool, easy way to dress up your outfit. I did that here with some straight leg jeans. This is such a dressy outfit, really perfect for drinks with your friends. It's a style guide to summer, right? So I wanted to show you one bathing suit outfit kind of dress up for maybe a boat party or a pool party. Here we have just this little two-piece set from Boohoo. I saw Julia Havens wearing it and she linked it and I was like, I'm gonna need to get that. But what I did was I just paired it with a chain belt that always dresses up your bathing suits, especially if you're like kind of self-conscious about like your midriff at all and you wear like high-waisted or even if you just love the high-waisted look, this just totally adds to it and just makes it super fun. Another trend that I tried to incorporate here are these square front sandals. It just makes your foot look longer to me for some reason. I love the squared front. Again, we have some more sheer. I got it from Windsor. I'm pretty sure it's still available. I will check and link it. But I love that it's floor length. It's so fun and it's totally sheer. I usually go to Vegas every June. Obviously not, but I would have worn this if I did. Just adds a really edgy touch to your bathing suit look. 
That is it for the video. Those are the trends for the summer. Summer is a not canceled, guys. I'm ready to wear these outfits out and in the streets. Thank you so much for watching. As always, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Click that little bell if you want to get notified when I post a new video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bring it around top. But I know that you're the only girl for me And I gotta let you know She likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine She likes notes that say I love you all